So occasionally when we're writing SQL statements, we're gonna wanna convert our data from one type to another. For example, maybe we wanna change a decimal to an integer. So let me show you how to do that. So we can use cast, that function, to convert data from one type to another. So let's say we have a number, and in this case, one row of the number is 2.7949. We could take that number and convert it as an integer. So cast this number as an integer. Cast is this conversion process. Now, as we do that conversion, we're gonna lose, in this case, a little bit of granularity because an integer is a whole number, a counted number, and so you're gonna lose a decimal and it's kind of just rounding up to the, um, the next integers there. So we're taking this number, converting it as an integer. Now I'm changing this a little bit now, so I'm casting this number or I'm converting it from its existing type to a decimal. Now it's listed or showing as a decimal right now, but what I'm saying is that only allow two spaces, that's the second digit there, after the decimal. So this will convert this to 2.79. It's gonna shorten it because that's all that, since I've done this conversion, that's all that new type is gonna allow. We could also take uh, the number in this case and cast it or convert it as variable characters or a text string. And so we're just gonna get a text string back in this case. So we can take different data types and convert them. Just know that in some cases we lose a little bit of detail, like when we convert this number to an integer and it rounds it up to three. Just something to be aware of as we handle these conversions, but we can take data and convert it from one type to another as we write our SQL statements using that cast function. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, click the subscribe button. And if you're interested in a SQL cheat sheet, you can find one over at codybaldwin.com.